hey everybody i am back with another video um hopefully this will be real real super super quick so i saw in one of the craft groups that i'm in i'm in a thousand craft groups um i saw where someone created a grinch door hanger using the wooden ornament um signs from the dollar tree so i decided to go ahead and try to do the same thing so this is what the ornament looks like i've already painted it green um for those of you all who have bought those ornaments they just look like the regular wood i went ahead and painted both sides um just for it to have a more finished look so i got this from the buck and the quarter store um it has a little string up there but i'm gonna cover that up so i bought this i did like two or three coats and if you can see it's like it actually went into the wood which is kind of not what i wanted i wanted the paint to kind of sit on top but you know it's like after every coat i would come back and it would just be absorbed into the wood so if you get a better paint um this is the paint that i used of course i got it from the dollar tree um and you know when you're buying stuff from the dollar tree you kind of get what you get so anyway so i used i got this right here is a dollar and a quarter i'm gonna go ahead and put it on my heat press i got my heat press set up at a 325 that's normally what i do when i'm pressing my t-shirts so the last um wooden door hanger that i did from the dollar tree i used um permanent vinyl and depending on the type of paint that you use the permanent vinyl just is not gonna stick so i'm using htv and my eyeball keeps falling out and i'm also using the glitter um let me see if i can find out where this goes yeah um so y'all know when you use glitter vinyl sometimes it just wants to come off because this, this vinyl's old anyway. So this is black glitter vinyl that I'm going to use to decorate this. Um, and then I got a hat from the Dollar Tree. Um, and then I'm going to need my glue gun and some glue sticks. So what I'm going to do, the way she had hers, I'm trying to make sure I got it on the right side. It's going to look like it's the Grinch's face. Um wearing a hat so what i'm gonna do so i can get my dimensions right i'm gonna put the hat on first just so i'll know how to position the face and then i'm gonna glue the hat down after i get the face so i need this to kind of know you know how i'm gonna position this so i think that's about good yeah so and then i'm gonna remove this now mind y'all <laughs> y'all know how i like to experiment and i like to experiment with y'all never done this before but hey we're gonna see this is gonna be a layered um one two so i'm gonna i'm gonna start off at 325 for 14 seconds and see how that goes the reason why i also chose glitter vinyl number one glitter is thicker than regular htv um and to me, glitter vinyl, vinyl pff, I can't talk. Glitter HTV adheres to uh, surfaces better than permanent to me. So, look at that. It's already on. Um, it looks like some of the black vinyl from the carrier sheet is sticking down, but that's okay. Um, and then I'm gonna put glitter on top of it. So here's the eye pieces, and I'm just gonna press those down. Let me um put that down. Glitter sticks better to me. I was gonna use regular um HTV to put on top of this glitter, but I kind of was like, nah, you better not. So I'm just gonna lay these on top. It should be on a carrier sheet, but this is just me reusing some vinyl. Uh-oh, let me turn that around. That I already had. 
this was a piece of vinyl that I, some glitter vinyl that I had that I cut some pieces off of it. So that's why it's not on the carrier sheet. Y'all, I re, oh Lord, it don't want to stick right. I reuse everything. Let me get my pick and move this around because we'll be here all day. Y'all know I'll, I'll be trying to do these short videos. All right. And I feel like I probably should have moved it more to the left, but that's okay. So again, we're going to press this for 325 for 14 seconds. Um, see, I originally had this other part cut in regular vinyl. Um, I just like glitter. And again, just like I said, to me, glitter sticks uh, to surfaces better. So, this is what we're looking like so far. Can y'all see the glitter? And then you can also see where this black glitter kind of... I'm going to cut my heat press off because I'm done now. Where the black glitter is kind of trying to stick in there from um, being on the carrier sheet. I think it's cute. It looks sideways, but the way they had their hat was kind of sideways too. So now I got my good old Dollar Tree hat. Um, and it's a cheap one. Again, this door knocker is going to probably, it's going to be for me. Um, and I'm going to put it on my door. So I'm going to put the hat on and kind of turn it sideways to make it kind of look like he's got his hat on sideways. And then I got my handy dandy glue gun. Um, I'm kind of scared to glue it. So I'm just going to put a dab right there. A dab in the middle. And then a dab right here. I don't want to go all the way across. Um, that glitter and that gold is just popping. <laughs> I'm glad I went ahead with that instead of going with this yellow because it just the glitter makes it look better. Um, and so then maybe I should glitter that glue glitter. I'll glue that piece just for it to, well, maybe, what you think? Should I glue it down or should I leave it? It looks more cohesive down like that. So I'm going to put just a dot of glue right here to hold that down. That is so cute. And I'll probably, and see, it just looks clean that the back is finished. And I'll probably um, get like a ribbon or something and loop it right here and glue it here um, so I can hang. Oh, look at that. My glue came undone. How disrespectful. Um, that is so cute. What y'all think? Um, and it was pretty cheap. The ornament wood hanger ornament thingy was a dollar and a quarter the hat was a dollar and a quarter the paint was a dollar um this is vinyl that i already had at home so and look at how the glitter just the eyes are just amazing um so this is a good way to do something a quick little um a cheap door hanger to put on your door i'm seeing a lot of people decorate their houses using the grinch um theme and so now i've jumped on the grinch train too so anyway yeah tell me what you think about this another dollar tree diy um uh, this was spontaneous i had had the idea and so i got up this morning i was like girl go ahead and record this video anyway happy thanksgiving to you guys this is sunday before thanksgiving so um in the event that i don't upload a video i may or i may not it just depends on how i'm feeling um lately I like crafting more. So, happy Thanksgiving to you all. Continue to stay safe and be blessed. As I always say, do whatever makes you happy. And for me, that's crafting.
Bye now.